what advice would you have to somebody who wanted to start an, an online business or a service business today? Well, I think it's the same in starting any business, whether it's today uh, or, or, or not. And the, and the biggest thing about starting business is you've got to be passionate about what you're doing. Mm -hmm. If you don't believe in what you're doing, there are a hundred other people who believe in a similar concept that are out there going to market. So you've got to believe in what you're doing. And then the other thing is you've got to have a product that solves somebody's problem. Mm -hmm. And you've got to be able to prove that, which means you've got to be able to get some revenue mm -hmm. to prove that. And if you can do those things and you can figure out how to bootstrap your way or finance your way into the business, that's the key to starting. So how did you at Sure Payroll solve somebody's problem and, and how did you prove to people that you actually did it? Mm -hmm. well, those are very important things when we were starting the business. So the first thing we did is we, we looked at the world and we realized that there was a better way of doing payroll for small businesses. Mm -hmm. And a lot of it has to do with the fact that small businesses have really been underserved in the payroll market. The biggest example of that is if there's 10 million small businesses out there, only one in four actually use a payroll service. That means three and four have never used a payroll service, mm -hmm. yet they all know that you can outsource payroll. Mm -hmm. So why is it three and four have never outsourced payroll for the last 45 years or so? Mm -hmm. And the biggest reason is because it's not as efficient, it's not as um, inexpensive as doing it yourself traditionally has been. And so we looked at that and we said there's a real opportunity to take a traditional way of doing things, calculating payroll, what is your the gross amount of your check, minus the deductions and earnings that you have, mm -hmm. taxes, getting to a net amount, mm -hmm. and then paying those taxes into the various federal and state agencies, and then filing the returns when they're due on a quarterly basis, on an uh, annual basis. And the traditional way of doing it with somebody like an ADP or Paychex is you phone in your payroll, mm -hmm. fax in your payroll, and even today, the majority of payrolls are done that way with ADP and Paychex, mm -hmm. and there's a little bit of the internet being used, mm -hmm. but it's only occasional. It's really for reports on an okay. ad hoc basis. And we said, with the power of the internet, there's a way of doing this much simpler, much more conveniently, with better accuracy. Um, we allow people to actually see the results of their payroll before they approve it, to preview it, to know to the penny, do I have enough money to make payroll, and is it right?